That's what a lot of this game is sometimes. Standing around. Waiting for things to get built. We'll put you right over here. <clears throat> Charge him up. Get the next one going. So, what do we got? Doesn't cost a lot of points here. What are we gonna need? Uh, so, medium shuttle is gonna be. Oh, I already bought it. Cool. Um, that soon. Actually, I'm going to need that one. But Glacio is very doable without a without a drill. So, we'll be going there shortly to pick up a bunch of research. Right, speaking of me need the packager. As soon as we get these rovers built, we'll start uh, going out and grabbing up a bunch of research, bringing it back here and getting it started because we get a big research grind now that we can carry more than one at, you know, at a, at a high rate of speed. So I can bring back three, four, yeah, I can bring back four at a time. All right, we got that uh, free cockpit, rover seat, and we will need. Well, that's right, I can't attach it to the back with the uh, cable plugged in. Right, you can't attach it to the rear slot with the cable plugged in. Alright, and that will operate on, I believe, uh, C or V. I don't know which one. I don't have this map like that anymore, so it's hard for me to say. But, uh, one, two, three. I'm pretty sure we can gather them uh, a lot faster than we can research them, even if I build another research module. But things we don't really need to, I guess, at this point. <clears throat> because I can build a medium shuttle right now. And go to Glacio and pick up some research that's worth... About 7,000 a piece. Yeah, I think what we're going to do is uh, head out with the truck, get some research, back to get our research started, go to another research station, get another one started, go back out, get three more, or uh, four more. Let's get a... Um Get an organic to stick on the back here. There we go.
All right, I'm going to take a little break, let the dog out here, and I'll be back in a little bit. All right, we're just going to try to go around here and keep the uh, base marker in sight. And uh, grab four, bring them back. Controls aren't working here. No, no, no. Gotta be on the front. Fine. Right on there. Run around and grab all this, uh, all this good stuff around here. Of course the Jeep does provide oxygen, but you cannot tether to it. If you have, a, if you have a oxy, oxygen right around, you can uh, tether to it just fine. But most of the time I really don't want to spend the room on it. Dead astroneer. That was a small wind turbine, which is nice. We don't have to make one. circle around to the north here and uh, we'll just keep the marker in sight and find some more research to bring back with us. There's one right there. Oops. Tethers.
Oh, there's another one right here. That's just me running out of power because I'm not, you know, I'm using the battery. You can actually drive around a large rover on a single uh, generator. All right, yeah, let's pull up around here actually. This is why I like the lane. You drive the rover right through it. There we go, that's better. And yes, okay. Um so I moved the uh, centrifuge back here because from here on out the printers in the uh, chemistry lab are going to be the primary tools we're going to be using. Uh, this will probably move over a little bit to make some more room for uh, centrifuge stuff. But... Just put that on there. I don't know if I, oh yeah. Derp. There we go. And this is not a gun pattern. One more compound. Yeah, yeah that's better. Spin it up. Run out here and grab the day's yummy bites here. Can't wait to get my oxygen tank. <clears throat> really get used to it. It's stuck on resources. Let's go over here towards the uh the gateway. Well, I guess we could bring those, uh... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Drive into my own pit here. Oh! There's one, there's two, there's three. Yay.
and stuff ahead. Mm, but there's some, there's some, ooh boy. Watch out for that. Boy, that's a hole. Three, and looky there's number four. Right. I mean, it's not that big a deal, you know, because... <laughs> that was close. Alright, don't fall into your own hole. So, yeah. You get a little dirt right here. See what's got enough oxygen. Oh, well, that is a battery. Very nice. That was uh, extenders. That's useful as well. Anything else over here? Alright, let's go. Boogie woogie back home and uh, these things dropped off. Well, it's going to charge me first. Oh, I have that battery on me. That's, that's what's going on. And so the system charges me. It's always me first anytime there's a power charging or power requirement thing. It's always the player first over any other machine, so it has, since the battery's on me, it has to charge the battery before it will charge the rover. There we go. Onward. Turn it off when the batteries get full, and uh, you know, these damn batteries. I'm not really hung up on a, on a tether. Rock this this rock. Out of here. 
Usually they disappear. I don't know why this one didn't. But, uh... piece of dirt right here. Yep. There we go. Let's get you away from my ramp is all. So this is what I'm going to do here. I'm going to grind out some research to get a few things that I need. And, uh, you know, it's not particularly exciting. Well, I guess it can be exciting. <laughs> I can almost fall to my death. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to try to be safe and do a little more. And I'll come back when we get closer to building a shuttle or go and probably go activate. Because these two generators here are enough to activate the uh, gateways on this planet. So, we can go actually do that. Why not, since we got the rovers here now. So, yep, we'll see what happens next time. Talk to you later.